an alpha. And I was joking, dude. I was being completely a smartass. And it is. It is an alpha cow. That's level 165 alpha cow. So, in fact, the bears aren't the toughest thing on the island, but this alpha cow is. Yo, what's going on, beautiful people? Riot's here punching this tree in front of you. I'm this heavily set gentleman. So I just recorded like 10 minutes of an episode and then realized I had Always Sunny in Philadelphia playing because the music or the freaking headphones are so loud. This seagull better not be attacking me. I'm not having any more damn beach birds steal crap from me like an Ark Survival Evolved. All right, so welcome to episode two. Today, we're just going to be getting into some epic stuff around the spawn place on this, um... This YouTuber streamer server because in like an hour or two They're gonna be closing it down and opening up the servers where everyone can play on and those are the ones I want to be doing my progress on because Obviously, I want to form giant pirate armies and tribes with you guys So um, definitely make sure to like the video if you want more atlas on my YouTube channel and um, here we go now We're picking up stones Punching stones does work, but it is also just degrading. Oh man sugarcane so yeah, and also make sure to follow me on Twitch because obviously I can't post like 12 hour videos on YouTube. I could, but they would just be very boring and not edited down. But I can do 12 hour live streams of Atlas. Obviously that's where our, our like a pirate arm is going to be doing most of its communicating too. So I want to make sure I have some extra things on me right now for when I start dying and dehydrating and all that lovely stuff. This is where you pick up the majority of stones as far as I can tell. Just once you start at the game by the way. You could punch rocks like a nerd, or you could just go right out into the shore and grab some stuff. What is going on here? He's got a nice little raft going. Yeah, dude, stone pick. Progress, baby. That's what I'm talking about. This craftable spear is my end game, but I need flint, obviously, to get it. But before I could get flint, I must have a pick to hit stone. Look at all that flint. Flint Eastwood up in here. Gran Torino. I don't know why I keep making puns. I think it's just because I'm hungry. I think I think puns are a hungry thing. There we go, man. I haven't seen a little wood. I wonder how much actually we should be gathering wood at a more ex more extensive rate with a pick. I don't think we're gonna at all, actually. I don't think a pick could gather. Wow, so fists are actually more effective with gathering wood than your pick is. Which sucks because really takes the piss out of you. Alright, nevertheless, we have a hatchet. And a pick. Baller. Should I make a torch too? Just for when it's nighttime, I suppose. Why not? What's the harm in having fire? What do we have over here? Wild rice. That was with the cane, right? Is this consumable? No, it's not. Sugar cane. It's a resource. Sugar. I would imagine you consume sugar, but what the hell do I know? All right, sweet. We have our torch, pick, and hatchet. The three starter resources of all Ark Survival Evolved base games. Now we can gather wood at a beautiful rate. As well as flint at a beautiful race. And then, of course, if you want to gather stone, I'm just going over this stuff for the noobs. Use the hatchet on a rock, and you get a buttload of stone. Now we've got a shite and ton of those three. Able to make... I would preferably like to make some more spears. I'd like to make, like, five, because obviously we're going to have to be chucking them. Like, they just do so much more damage when you throw them as to when you poke them, and I imagine they're not going to be that powerful, you know? It's, it's just a little spear. It's a sharp rock, essentially. Hey, ah! hey guys. Excuse me. Oh, gave me a heart attack. What's going on, buddy? What's the time? Close the... Close the... For me, I'm in the, Pacific the... time, which um, I'm in the time zone where the game devs are supposed to be. For me, it is 11 a.m. So, like, 11 Thank in the you. morning. Yes, sir. Please be nice. Please leave me peacefully. All right, cool. Thank you, bro. Sweet. Yes. Some of our brothers from across the seas. That was actually beautiful right there. That I brought a little bit of a tear to my eye. The camaraderie. That gives me faith right there that it might not be such a cancerous community, which I was severely worried about because everyone went batshit crazy on the developers when they kept putting it off, which was weird because, I mean, are you guys not used to it by now? Who honestly didn't see that coming? Oh, crap. I'm hot. And they don't mean sexy. Now, I do have 0% wetness going on. See, in the bottom right corner, you can see. Now we're like, 0% wet. How are we still 0% wet? What? I'm at least 50% wet, you crackhead. What if I dip? Oh, there we go. Now we're 99% wet. No longer hot. All right. So if there's one creature I want to go ahead and stick my spear in, it was that bear originally. It would have been cool to kill a bear. But then I saw that manta ray creature over here, which is... And I've glided off and died in the middle of the ocean. 
So I'm a fairly novice professional, I guess, which is an ironic thing to say. Or not ironic, just stupid. But as far as I can tell, this is one of the biggest things you can find in the ocean. Aside from obviously all the giant stuff you find in the ocean that isn't immediately outside of the starter map. Alright, I just saw something big and scary down the water over there. I'm fully prepared to die and have to come fetch my stuff. That's where we'll get a good lesson in um, how difficult it is to regather your items. Assuming, of course, you died right outside a base. See, there is something that looks generally wolfy over there. It looks wolfy as hell, which sounds stupid to say. Wolfy? That's not a sentence. That's not a word grown men use unless they're addressing a furry, I suppose. No, it's a horse. It ain't no wolf. Wow, I almost crapped my pants. I'm all preparing for warfare and everything. I was about to bring in the heat. All right, so back to sea monster hunting. There's that damn bear. S.O.B. I am afraid of you. Well, you're absolutely goddamn correct. Perhaps I should make some make some cloth armor before attempting any sort of hunt. Does it really give you that? It gives you five armor. Perhaps it adds up because that's just a hat. I mean, it is just fiber. It's not like you necessarily have to work for it. Even hide armor is generally going to be easy to come by because there's warthogs all over the damn place. I'm sorry, little monkey. I'm sorry, little man. Had to be done. At least it's a lot freaking easier with the spear. Where is this damn monkey? There we go. This is just a million times easier to, um... See, he drops pelts, not hide. Whoa there! Alright, I'm gonna be re No, see, this is the thing, though. I made this mistake last time when I was just messing around. When you kill these pigs, they all kind of go aggro on you. What about you, chicken? What do you drop? Skin! We have just different variations of stuff. Wait, but it all counts towards the same. Hide, it counts towards hide, but this is skin. And that's, um, what was the other thing? Pelt? But I guess it's all, it, all, it all counts towards the same thing. Sweet! I definitely wish I had a fire already. Let's get one of those going. Whoa! Oh, but that movement is crazy about the damage. Go! Quite effective monkey hunting. I can barely reach the monkey. I feel like I'm just too tall. All right, I'm definitely gonna go... Err, stamina. Stamina running out seems to be a horrible issue in my life. Here, I'll worry about that in a second. Let's just make sure we have... Is that really all we can make so far? We just need a lot more fiber. All right. Fiber is the easy one to get. Okay, let's go over to skills. Let's see here. We are now, which one of you, I guess, would offer me... You offer water skin. Your adva Whoa, swimming speed. You move us towards more tools. You give us a lot of freaking things. Oh my lord, look at all those. That's a lot of stuff. What about over here though? Construction and mercantilisms? Oh, this is like base building. I definitely said that word wrong. What about over here? Hand-to-hand -hand combats, dexterity, block counterattacks with fists up 10%. Shrug it off. Receive negative or, uh, plus 20% torpor. Stamina drain with fist weapons. See, that one sounds very useful. I'm going right for that one. Like, it doesn't sound very useful long run, obviously, but right now, very much so. I want to tame you so bad, female horse. But obviously, that's not an option right now. Who are you dehydrated? Oh, this is where I always die. Fresh water quickly by digging in the ground. How the hell do you dig in the ground, though? Okay, see now while I'm asking questions to the entire server, I definitely regret a little bit making my people's name your mother's ass. Lay on the ground and click. Let's see, greener. I must thank them first before I go seeking greener land. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm over here like on the sound. Sound. Sand. Sound. Where's greener land, dude? It's all just sand. I'm done for, but now we know for future reference at least. Okay, what about this? Can't live by greener grounds. Your mother! That hill looks pretty greeny up there. No, I'm not worthy of it. Man, those bears are terrifying. Thank God they're like completely docile unless you piss them off. What about right here, dude? Oh, yeah. Oh, I missed it. I didn't know it was like a thing. Yeah, dude, enjoy that sweet, delicious land nectar. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, damn it, I keep forgetting. Dude, drink the poop out of that. This, that is dope right there. Wow, that's crazy. What a crazy way to find water. Water is depleted in this area. 
We got some hydration going. We took a lot of damage in that process. Our beans are cooked, ladies and gentlemen. Damn, how far does water depletion travel? I wonder if it carries over for different players. Could have solved that issue so long ago. Just drinking some damn water. I, I imagine drinking pee would be an option before dying. Nah, I'd rather die. Alright, well since we're gonna freaking pretty much die anyways, might as well cook us up a nice snack. I don't know, it might keep us alive. It might grant us some sort of health or something. What is the purpose of you? Clearly just for crafting, but I feel like there's gotta be more to it. Or am I just on crack? I don't know, if it has the same um, tendencies as art, then art, arc, then eating shall uh, heal some of our health as well, which would be fi quite fantastic. I'm gonna run up here to see if I could access a new water spout or something. Your boy's dying. Oh, 60 water. And we're thirsty again. This guy's ridiculous. Drama queen. We're gonna die of dehydration no matter what. It's just too hot. Let's go take a splish splash. I imagine that'll help us dehydrate slower. We don't have some kind of extra heated um, symbol in the corner though, meaning we're not, there's not like some sort of heat stroke taking place. What do I do if I wrecked my raft? <laughs> This should definitely help us, um, because now our wetness, our wetness is up. It should help a little with, uh, overheating. How quick do we dry off? 97, 96. Oh, we dry off quite slowly, actually. Taking a dip in the water is good for your health. There's some giant fish. Y'all are some big fish. I could just poke you guys, right, and come out here with a big fish. My spear broke? What kind of fish is this? I guess it says it right above it is. Oh my god. Hey, I'm just gonna get out of the water because... That was spooky. Oh, there's one of these guys. What's going on, S.A.? Que paso? What is that? Is that a sea base too? Or bass? Sea base. No, that's something else. That's a tuna. Come on, dude. Can I throw spears in the water? I can, and I can miss them, too. It's going down. Oh! Oh, no! No! No, 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 no! Come on, dude, I can't even swim upward. Oh, because I'm holding a stupid spear! Swim up! Oh my god, damn it, dude, I, that, that fucker came out of nowhere! How's the motif around here with animals even? Okay, there we go. There's my death beacon. There's like bears and cows. This is this Jerboa? You're a Jerboa. I don't care what that says. All right, so now we're on a little rescue mission. Operation Retrieve My Crap from the giant shark patrolling the land over here. I can't believe I just said that. I commentate for a living and I said it's patrolling the land. The land, it's a shark. Dumb bitch. I'm just gonna grab it really quick. That's not what's gonna happen. Going for it. It's off in the distance. It's over there still. Must get crap. Come here. Nope. God damn it. Now we're talking. There's a transfer all button. Thank God there's a transfer all button. I was not swimming up the correct time last time, or the correct way last time at all, and now it's now painfully obvious to me. All right, you dirty sea shanty. We gotta wait 10 seconds before we could use this? I guess that makes it's just eating all the fish right now. Le fish. <laughs> I'm way too obvious right now. The drowning sound scared the crap out of me. I imagine if I had a raft, this would be a thousand times easier, but I'll have plenty of time to do that on the official server. I feel like I just gotta go stick a f stick a fork in it. You were almost dead as is. You're not even. You're stupid. All right, he's coming. He's coming. They're both kind of making their way over here. Ja -ja! Yeah, you better run. Damn, I'm 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 a tough fella. That thing's just got a spear in his face. Come on, shark. Make my day. 
Come on, man. They repair too quick. Hey, that's kind of a cool me mechanic. You get a wood when your pick breaks. I didn't notice that before. Like, you somewhat gather some of the crap back off of it. All right, with my 17 spears, I s I'm going to give that... I'm gonna give that bastard a run for his money. All right, just like an arc, the spears divide up into piles of 10. I like that similar mechanic, stuff I'm used to. Can only hold one stack though. Also very similar to what I'm used to. All right, with these spears that I hold in my invisible pocket, I shall dominate this sea bitch or die trying. My name isn't Morpheus. It's not, my name's not Morpheus. I think just one more being crafted, right? And we're in business. Where'd you go, coward? Dude probably took off after I put that spear in him. He realized that I was not a boy, but a man. And hit the bricks. I know you ain't bringing that heat over here. Shabuya! Let's go drag our sea beasts to the shore. But dude, this water is scary as hell at night. I don't like this at all. I don't like any part of this. Wow, we're just body surfing this giant beast. Play the stinger on that thing. Good lord. Yes, release the body. Obviously, I don't want to make sweet love to it. Not while I'm filming. Man. Get a gander at this pappy. Pretty cool looking beast. I like how it's upside down. It's all curled up like an arachnid upon its death. Got a nice face hole. And the stinger. Look at that Steve Irwin killer right there. I know that may have been an inappropriate, or inappropriate thing to say, but he was my childhood hero too, and I think about it every time. Give me your fish oil. Alright, let's see you harvest mostly with an axe or with a hatchet. Let's see what you harvest mostly with a pick. Same basic resources. Looks like you even get more fish oil with a pick, though, than a hatchet. Fish oil used for general fishy stuff. I can't go in there to hunt the bees because it's night time. I mean, we can, but we won't see anything. I wonder if the beast is even around here anymore. I Half of me thinks he just took off completely. Coward. I am pretty awesome. This turtle just cruising way down deep. I don't really understand that that much. I guess that makes perfect sense, actually. It just doesn't look like a sea turtle. It looks like a tortoise. It looks like a tortoise deep in the water. All right, let's descend. Dive. Dive. Are you hoping I'm going to see the outline? Some monstrous outline making its way towards me. I think the beast straight up bailed though. Which I suppose is pretty nifty considering if you're, um, you know, trying to stay alive and one of them's trying to kill you, I'd prefer that they would leave if you did a lot of damage to them so you don't always just have to kill them. All right, fine. If I can't hunt the biggest thing in the water right now, then I'll hunt the biggest thing on land right now. Is that bull on fire? No, that cow is an alpha. Is it an alpha cow? An alpha? It, I was joking, dude. I was being completely a smart ass. And it is. It is an alpha cow. That's level 165 alpha cow. So, in fact, the bears aren't the toughest thing on the island, but this... Alpha cow is. <laughs> oh, it's got a lot of health! Oh, it's Jesus, dude! Okay. Alright, okay. I'm regretting decisions I've made. I can't even turn around, I don't think. No, I know. No, I can. I had a feeling I could. I was like, wait, I don't know. Yeah! Oh, Jesus Christ! Dude, that alpha cow, that alpha cow is like a thousand times stronger than the shark. Holy crap. Holy crap, I found an alpha and it is beast. It's a cow. I like how there is alphas in this game. I had no idea that there would be alphas in this game until the alpha cow. Now imagine the alpha shark. Good God. I like how far your death beacon travels. Oh, it has a big skull up there too. It's a lot more painfully obvious than I thought it would be. Man, alpha cow, what a lot to take in right there. Woof! Yeah, I, I, I would need to sit down if I wasn't, um, well, if I wasn't already sitting down. There it is, the big alpha you bitch. What up, dude? What's cooking good looking? 
I don't think any sort of beginner armor I can craft is gonna make any sort of difference. I think our tactic was foolproof, to be honest. Just, uh, you know, hit him with spears. This is where we could do it, I guess, is if our, uh, everything, everything was just way higher. Oh, brass knuckles, what? Dude, that's what I'm going for first. Brass knuckles, what? These are crazy. Martial fit. Brass knuckles. This is the first thing I'm going for in the whole game right there. Maybe the cow's not as good of a fighter in the water. It's the only tactic we could really hope for right now is that somehow it gets horribly slowed down in the water and we're able to just prod the shizen out of it. See, his health repairs instantly. It's, it sucks. They, they, they're so strong. Get in the water! They do follow you into the water. I like that. And I can hit him from down here without him hitting me. I knew this would work out. This kind of stuff always works out. But now the cow's gonna run, and this is where it gets hard. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah! Okay, dude. If I had a little bit more stamina or just planned that out a little bit better... Hey, I just got a subscriber on Twitch. If I had planned that out a little bit better then that would have been legit. You guys cannot argue that that is as far as the game started. Like, if I had any sort of prep time, even if the servers weren't shutting down in 20 minutes and I really wanted to do this, then I would be able to do that. That underwater technique is flawless, son. Flawless. It's just a stamina and breathing issue. But I had its health down a good amount. And if I wasn't a one-shot and actually had a bed over in this location so I could keep respawning instantly while it's, before his health could decrease, I'm in repair. Then I would be able to slay that alpha and it would be damn sexy. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here though so I could go ahead and get ready for the official servers where we could make our pirate armies and it's gonna be amazing. So yeah, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, and I'll see you beautiful people there. Peace!